changing circumstances, still becoming better. How do you do that? Very simple realization. What is transition? Transition is, well, first letting go of the old. Makes us sad, makes us angry. We want the old thing. During a pandemic, you find like, I want to have all my old life back. I want to go out. I want to have what, have what I had. That could really even result into being angry or, or pretending that the old place is still there. Then there is the, there's the middle phase of change, of transition. It's like, well, I don't have the old right now. I can't have that. I accept that there is this thing going on in my life, whether it's COVID or a life change that you have, a loss that you have. It's where the new thing is not, you haven't started on that yet. You know the old thing is gone and you're sitting there. People get scared here. They get anxiety. I don't know what to do. I, I, I don't know what to do. Stuck. And then there's the third phase of transition, which then says, okay, let's get to work. Let's create a new project. Let's create a new goal. Let's self-actualize. Let's start. And that is sort of like, that knowledge is sort of like, hey, how do we navigate? Some people are still stuck in the first phase in this pandemic. It's crazy. They, they want that, they're angry. They want to have, oh, whoa, well, my, my face mask. No, in the old world, we didn't have face masks. So then it means it's not real. And it doesn't work that way. Also the insecurity that causes people to immobilize and sit afraid doesn't work either. The third way is like, how do we navigate our lives, our ever changing lives? It's about getting into action. It's getting into doing, stop talking to stop time on social media, start self-actualizing. That's what it is about. Because then you can benefit in the future. You can use this time wisely.